happening today. Some financial relief for millions of families. The first payments in the Biden administration's enhanced child tax credits are set to roll out. It's aimed at giving families with children hundreds of extra dollars, but not everyone will get it. Mark Lehman is live at the IRS office in Maitland. There are some exceptions to this, Mark. Yes, since it is a child tax credit, you do need to have a child under 18 to qualify. In addition to that, there are also income thresholds of 112,000 for head of household and 150,000 if filing jointly. Those who meet those requirements are starting to receive their payments this morning. As part of a massive COVID relief package passed this year, millions of American families are set to receive the first payments from the Biden administration's expanded child tax credit. It's not as a credit against your taxes, but a direct payment. You'll get cash. Half of the credit can be claimed when filing income taxes, but the other half will come monthly, up to $300 per child under six and up to $250 for children six to 17. If you have a child living in your home for more than half the year, also important that if, as long as the child has a social security number, you are eligible for the child tax credit. Households that filed a return in the last couple of years and claimed the regular child tax credit will get payments automatically, but families are eligible even if they didn't meet the income threshold to file. The IRS partnering with nonprofits to reach households that may not file a return. If you didn't file taxes, there are some Americans who don't have to file taxes. There is a tool, a portal for the IRS at the irs.gov website, and you can actually put your information in there, and that will entitle you to the credit. Each of the payments are scheduled for around the 15th of every month and will run until the end of 2021. Uh, the expanded child tax credit is for this year only, but Democrats have said that they're pushing for it to continue next year as well. For now, reporting live in Maitland, Mark Lehman, Getting Results News 6.